Look at how alone we are. Look at how quietly we think. Look at how when we leave the farm, we represent the family. Look at how much of ourselves is taken away from us. Look at how there are so many laws in place which protect our free thinking. But when we take a law and we write it that says that you can think whatever you want, there in the background, there's always that thing, that unwritten rule, the social contract. Which says, you can't think what you think. You cannot allow other people to see what's going on in your mind because by allowing us to think for ourselves, we take away civil civilization. We lose a little bit of all that. It goes all the way back to the caveman times. when the one that was just a little bit better at doing things talked too loud and they fucking beat his head in with a rock. That's what we do these days. If you speak too loud, they're gonna beat your head in with a rock. You shut the fuck up. I finally figured this out. You can see it goes right to that. The things that we don't like are the things that we're not good at. But if you find you you practice it, you practice it, you practice it, you get better at it, suddenly it's not so bad after all. However, it's acceptable to not try. It's acceptable just to put somebody in a hole, tell them, shut the fuck up. Are you trying to make this better? I haven't even figured this part of it out yet. Nothing's gonna get any better if you can't get any better at it. And that's where we're at. Why is it you can look 50 to 70 years back and see the same qualms, the same problems? It's because the mass is trying to keep you down. <laughs>